y'all welcome to my beauty room so as you can see my beauty room is a hot mess this is usually where i do my makeup and today we are going to declutter this and turn this into my office slash beauty room what's up y'all welcome back to my channel i'm destiny and as you can see starting off my beauty room is super small and then i decided that i was going to incorporate making my lip glosses and stuff here on my desk table rather than making it on my dining room table and with all the stuff that i already have in here it just made the room even smaller so the first thing I'm going to do is remove everything off of the table and I also have a little trash bag in the back that you guys can see and um, put the trash in there of course and just put things uh, temporarily where they're going to be for right now so that I can remove this table out of here and just have more room to walk around and play stuff on the floor if I need it and also clean it. So one, the floor was already a mess, and two, I forgot the table had a second shelf. So when I moved it, all the stuff that's on the second, second, why am I saying second? On the second shelf had just fell on the floor, which was okay because it needs to be cleaned. Anywho, so right now I'm just going through everything on the floor basically and throwing away trash and picking up stuff. Um, off the floor to see if it's expired and as you can see like anybody that find anything we're gonna play with it so i was playing with a ysl two shade cloth primer like sample one of them and yeah i'm just trying to see if i wanted it or not and then i found the lip gloss and i'm basically just check checking the consistency of it like to see if it's expired or how it feels in the hand how it looks like maybe i might test it out I don't know, but it's a lot of untested up on makeup in my makeup room, and I just have to play with it. So this thingy right here, um, I'm basically going to use this for my makeup brushes. So clean brushes, dirty brushes, old brushes, new brushes, all of it is going to go in that little tub thing, and um, I'll separate them and clean them later on in a different video. I literally had so many things in here that I could have given away, but I had forgot about it because some of the stuff been in here since I started makeup, which is way back in 2015, and I moved in this house in 2015, and I wasn't going to give y'all nothing expired, but that's like four years ago. But I do have a few things that I want to give away, like makeup bags that you will see later on in the video. And I want to do that randomly when you order from our company. So be sure to shop Beauty Beast Cosmetics. And I also film a video of me sticking it in there. So will it be you? So make sure you guys shop BeautyBeastCos.com. trash fast enough my grandma gave me this wig she knows she wrong for that <laughs> but anyway here's what the floor is looking like so far and next we're about to tackle what's under the shelf that you see right there yeah all that we're going to tackle that and let's get to it Under here is where I normally keep my wigs for filming, um, Christmas lights, well 
Riverdale's. Um, if you're OG from when I first started making YouTube um, makeup tutorials, then you know um, I had a turtle back in the day, and the turtle tank used to be over here in the makeup room with me, and we used to fight because this turtle tank be making all that noise. <laughs> but um, so yeah, I kept a uh, Rossi stuff down here, and I also have. Um, stuff for my filming equipment and stuff like that so like um, my, my ring light um, filters and stuff like that and my kids like to play hide and seek under here so you can see a lot of household clothes and stuff <laughs> in here that don't belong um yeah so I'm just cleaning this up and this long pole you see in front of me this is actually one of my studio lights I'm going to move out the way in a moment so I can vacuum but this is normal what goes under here and so I'm basically planning on um, pushing some of that stuff to the back like the ones you already see back there and also putting my printer, my extra large printer up in here and my um, shredder. So you guys will see a lot of Mary Kay stuff because my best friend sells Mary Kay and some of the stuff I don't even know why I kept it because I can't use it and I don't want to use it. I had a very bad reaction to their cleansing for sensitive skin and dry skin or whatever it was and I just don't want it. <laughs> so I threw out a lot of Mary Kay stuff but if you guys do shop Mary Kay, uh, like I said, my best friend is a consultant, and if you want to get anything, just hit me up, and I'll let her know. Look at that. Should have been in the trash, but no. Who kept it? I did. This is horrible. This is how I become a makeup whore. trash and moving right along we are going inside of this cabinet that I have never been inside since moving in here I got old tax returns old makeup brushes from when I first started um, doing makeup I wasted a lot of money when I look at this video I'm looking at a lot of money that I wasted not knowing how to do makeup so um, a lot of these brushes, um, when I first started, I didn't know what they were used for or how to use them, so I kept them inside of the little packs, and I was also contemplating giving away the makeup uh, brush holder packs because it could have gone to somebody else because they were still brand new. I had never used them. I just took the brushes out and then stuck them under there. But they were dirty, so I decided not to give them away. How did they get dirty? I don't know. I don't, I don't remember. But I could have just simply wiped it off and gave it to you guys. Because that would have been a nice little treat for you guys. But I didn't even think about it till now. And then I have this random laptop and battery pack that don't even go together. Like, I don't even know why I kept that. So, yeah, don't mind me. And then I have this nail dryer that... It took me about three minutes to figure out if I wanted or not, and then I decided to exit. So, yeah. And if you are OG again, you know those makeup brushes I use those for my makeup don'ts video. So, <laughs> if you haven't seen that, don't watch it. You know, it's just there for fun. So, if you haven't seen it before, do not watch it. It's cringy. I'm just letting you know now. And then we're on to the top drawer. Like I said, this is the reason why I say I, I wasted a lot of money. Because I bought this 120 eyeshadow palette. You guys can't see me swatching it. But I just wanted to see like how does it look. And it's super chalky. No pigment at all. And then I bought this contour palette. As you can see. Well, I didn't show you guys. But, um... That's not my shade. <laughs> that was a super bright and ashy. I couldn't use it. And then the Profusion palette. My lovely. My very first shimmer palette. Palette period, I believe. Yeah, but she's going in the trash. And then I have this, which is also a waste of money. 120 um, pressed glitters. 
mm, in the trash. <laughs> yeah, then I have a bunch of knockoff um, eyeshadows. My family love, knows I love makeup, so they bought me some stuff that they got from the dollar store. And it's not pigment set, so I can't use it. I've tried them, and they just don't get it. So, in the trash they go. And then we're going to clean out this cabinet drawer. That's what it is. Drawer. <laughs> I wanted to move um, some stuff inside as I go through that way I can see how much space it is and then like I said I can get organized all in between rather than clean up and then bring stuff in I can go ahead and do it while you know I clean out each section so now I'm just bringing in my extra large printer and shredder and I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to situate things and this little desk thingy, whatever you want to call it. Um, so I bring in my yoga mat, tripod, and hair, filming hair or whatever. And I stuck it behind it because like I said, when I film, I can just grab. And then um, I put the shredder back in front of everything. And I apologize for mooning you guys. <laughs> But I put my shredder in the front so when I get to, I can get all those papers that need to be shredded. So moving right along to my middle shelf. And up here we got more of Rossi stuff, important papers, lip glosses, lipsticks. Um everything that you can think of is up here on the second show so we're gonna go through this and we're basically seeing what i like so i'm starting off with the nail polishes that i don't want they've expired or um yeah expired or oh, that's not the color i'm gonna use i just threw them in the trash this plate here <laughs> is literally when I started making my lip glosses in 2016 and I was using uh what was I using eyeshadow um clear lip gloss uh what else did I use lip balm strawberry scented lip balm and yeah, those little eyeshadow thingies I showed you guys. I was using that to make lip glosses at first. And oh my lord, I'm going to have to see if I still have that on my personal um, on my personal Instagram account. So make sure you guys are following me at Destiny Moshe. And scroll all the way down to the bottom if it's still there. And you will see what I mean by that. <laughs> when I first started, lord, it was funny. But yeah, so these are just palettes and stuff like that that I need to get rid of. So this palette is the palette I used in um, my Makeup Don'ts video. <laughs> it's one of the very first palettes that I ever had, ever. And my husband bought that for our anniversary um, when we were dating. Lord, the memories of that palette. <laughs> Let's go through the lipsticks and lip glosses now. So you see how many we're starting off with. And we're getting rid of, I think, over half of them. Because um, like some of them came in the little... Uh, box set you're going to see later on with the palette I just showed you and you know it's like little kitty stuff so I got rid of those 
um, this um, white one in this, that you see in the front, that's um, actually from Bite Beauty. It was one of my favorite lip glosses, it's iridescent, um, and it smelled really good, like orange juice, I think. But um, I don't know how it broke, so it kind of like dismembered its own self. <laughs> So I got rid of one of those. Um, I got rid of a lot of them. That um, small, like fuchsia-ish one. That was one of my favorite lipsticks of all time. Like I love that. I'm gonna see if I can make that into a lip gloss. I have to find the pigments to recreate that color. So the banister was pretty easy most of the stuff here I threw in the trash um, because for one Texas blush for example not my shade at all it's super ashy on me so I threw that in the trash that tart um, blush I never even swatched it that's another thing I could have gave to you guys but I didn't think about it for now so um, I keep my eye out for stuff like that I'll you know start thinking about you guys more often and um, this is just a handful of swatches I don't even want to know why I swatched that and even showing it to you guys <laughs> but yeah so like I said most of the stuff isn't even my color um, and all went in the trash this palette right here is actually a cream eyeshadow palette um, my people know that I love makeup but they don't know the difference in quality of makeup so you know that was just trash <laughs> and I threw it in the trash um and the other stuff I kept and like I said this is super easy to clean that I that liquid foundation I threw in the trash because it wasn't my color I'm not too much of a makeup artist I mean I did some dabble there here and there for like friends and family but other than that I'm not a makeup artist and then on to um this little area right here <clears throat> So, uh, what I have here is junk. <laughs> so, I'm just moving stuff out the way. That was my tart. I mean, my Better Than Sex mascara. This blanket that you guys see hanging right here was actually like a DIY project. I was using that blanket to, um, like extra length for my backdrop to go across my balcony. Because I was using my light for my window to film my video so you know and then this buxom i believe i gave one away for um a giveaway i did back in the day because i know i usually buy two of everything and i was just trying to decide if i wanted to keep it or throw it in the trash but i decided to keep it for like decorative purposes and stuff <music>
Um, we making progress. We are basically gathering all the brushes and lip liners at this moment. I find little eyeshadow palettes and a trinket pen now that I gotta look and see if I actually want. But for the most part, we're just getting brushes and lip liners, um, lip glosses, stuff like that, and also putting like all my business stuff inside the drawers and wherever I'm gonna put them at for right now. And right here, this is one of the loop boxes that I I made back in the day. I have a few of those that I, I um I made, but that's one of them. Oh my gosh, y'all, we're making progress. You can actually see my countertop. Hey, get it. Hey. <laughs> I was jamming at, yeah, I was jamming at Bruno Mars. He. I love his music. If you ain't on Bruno Mars, you need to get your game up. Cause Bruno Mars is where it's at. Like, he be my boyfriend. Like, yeah, <laughs> Bruno Mars my boyfriend. But yeah, I'm jamming the clean. I'm just happy. Like, I can see my kind of top, so we can all celebrate this achievement together with Bruno Mars. <laughs> shop with me because the next few people will be getting a special surprise for me so be on the lookout with your order don't forget to shop beautybeatscos.com and yeah enjoy the rest of the video don't forget to like subscribe and comment give me a thumbs up and yeah enjoy the rest of the video
your own. It's lit like this is a whole nother day, so I have makeup on my day, so forgive me. <laughs> but stay tuned for part two. Basically, I will be going over um like how everything is organized, semi-organized, or whatever you want to call it. Um, and probably do like um inventory slash organizing my business slash office slash makeup room and i'll probably do like a do inventory with me video as well so i hope you guys enjoyed watching me declutter i'm so happy now that i actually have room to do stuff <laughs> and it's a little bit more clean and sanitized now so um yeah don't forget to order with beauty beats cosmetics and if you like this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe as well. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.